Hey, welcome back. It's Ralph. Uh, just giving you guys a quick update on myself again. Uh, so I decided to do P9GX2 as I told you before. Um, I'm going to do it with my wife this time, so hopefully she can hang. If you're watching, you better hang. Um, so, uh, did the fit test yesterday, which was Sunday, December 16th, I believe. And uh, it went well. You know, it was, we did it early in the day and it was cold. It's been raining here in Southern California. And, um, you know, it went well. And, um, you know, I did, uh, went through the whole fit test. I was very happy with my heart rate and I uh, give thanks to Asylum for that. Um, it went well. You know, uh, my heart rate recovered really quick. And so I'm really happy about that. And um, because my heart rate, you know, has been, you know, is better, um, I feel like it's going to allow me to recover between exercises in P90X2 a lot faster. And um, that's about it, you know. It's going to help me. Oh, big deal. And so I was also, I was impressed with my wife's fit test. Um, I underestimated her a lot, and I feel like she's going to adapt very well to P90X2. And, you know, the, the variety in it is really going to keep her interested in it. Uh, let's see. I'm still, I'm still at 10 pull-ups, and my goal is to get 15. Uh, 40 push-ups, I was really impressed with myself with that, to get the 40 push-ups in a row. And I had really good form on all of them. Uh, my goal is to do 60. I'm really hoping to get that. It's a little a high of a goal, but... That's my goal. Uh, let's see, my curls, I did 16 curls at 25 pounds. Uh, my goal is to do 15 at 30 pounds with perfect form. Uh, let's see. Uh, my vertical leap, I was 19 inches and my goal is to get it to 22 inches. And my in and outs was 60 and my goal is 100. So uh, my goals with P90X2, I had to write all this stuff down, obviously, because uh, I didn't really think about it. Uh, let's see. Uh, my goals here are to increase my core stability, uh, you know, keep in shape for baseball. As you know, I'm going to be starting baseball on the 6th of January, uh, 2013. Uh, let's see. I want to increase my flexibility, especially, you know, with the yoga um, and the, the foam rolling that's involved with P90X2. Um, I want to shed, shed some fat, but you know, gain a little bit of muscle, but mostly, you know, shed some fat. Um, another goal of mine is to help Cynthia throughout, you know, Cynthia and my wife. Hi, Cynthia. Hello. Uh, I want to help my wife, you know, stay motivated with the program and, you know, hopefully get her more involved in, in you know, what, what I do, what I enjoy doing. Um, let's see. Um, I would like to meet my fit test goals as well. And my most important goal is to get the shirt, the P90X2 shirt. Um, you know, hopefully I can get to it. And let's see, uh, among, under, among other, ah, excuse me, among other things, uh, my speed bag work has been going pretty well. I'm still doing great. You know, I feel like I'm hitting a, a small speed bump. Um, I feel like my hands, I'm coming kind of down, downward a lot, and I need to focus on hitting the very center of the bag. So that when I'm hit, you know, when I hit down, it doesn't stop. And you might see that in some of the videos that I've done. Uh, but you know, I recover quickly from that. Also, um, you know, I'm working on my transitions, transitioning my rhythms, going from one, one, two, one, two, one, two, to going one, 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 one. The way you see Rocky do it in all, all his training montages. Um, let's see. Also, want to work or work on walking around the platform. Um, you know, that's a little tough for me, changing the direction of the speed bag and picking it up early. I, I get really uncoordinated with it, but, you know, I'm barely a month into it. Uh, let's see, I want to work on, you know, bouncing. i seen uh, Manny Pacquiao do it on, in, in his uh, speed bag training on a YouTube video that I watched. You know, he kind of bounces like that and just, you know, keeps his rhythm going. And it's a little tough for me to do, so I'm going to work on that. Um, so basically, you know, with the speed bag, it's like learning to jump rope, learning how to jump rope and mixing in different tricks, you know, just doing baby steps at a time. Um, and let's see, that's about it. That's all I have for this, this uh, video. Uh, so I'll see you guys next time. Take care.